Hello, my name is Catherine Feely and I'd like to welcome you to the Crypto Academy Coinbase Payment Methods. In this video, we will walk you through the steps for linking your bank account to your Coinbase account, setting up a local currency wallet, and making a deposit. The first thing you'll do is go to the Coinbase site, which is at www.coinbase.com and you're going to click on sign in. You're going to use the email address and password that you used to create this account. Then you're going to click on sign in. Make sure you have your phone ready to receive your two factor authentication code. Fill in the seven digit code and click verify. Before we start the process of linking your bank account to your Coinbase account, please ensure that you've completed the checklist below. Make sure that you completed the identity verification process, KYC and our verify. And also make sure you complete your member profile. This will be really beneficial for the different types of accounts that you want to link. If you haven't done this, we would like to suggest that you go back to the previous video, 3C, Coinbase, registering and verifying your account, which will lead you through this process. And then once you've completed that, you can come back to this video. There are several types of payment methods that you can link to your Coinbase account based on your location. And you can find that information out at the Coinbase site under their FAQs. You can find out if your location lets you have a bank account or a credit card, debit card, or a bank wire. From the dashboard, you're going to click on settings. From the settings tab, you're going to click on linked accounts. And then what you're going to notice is that you haven't linked any accounts yet. We're going to click here on link a new account. This is where we're going to choose our preferred payment method that we want to link. For smaller amounts, we recommend using the credit debit card method. And the reason we say for smaller amounts, it's faster. We're using the debit credit card but there's also fees that are charged. For larger amounts, we recommend using a bank account. It can take up to four to seven business days, but there are no deposit fees. You will also need to link your bank account for withdrawals. What we're gonna do here is we're going to show you how to link your bank account. From this list, you're going to choose your bank name. For example, there's Chase, TD Bank, Wells Fargo. If you don't see the bank you use listed here, you're gonna choose other bank. But for the purpose of this demonstration, we are going to use the Bank of America. When linking your bank account to your Coinbase account, Coinbase provides you with two verification options. Option number one is the instant verification, and most banks can be linked instantly and securely by providing your online banking username and password when requested. Additional security questions as well as a PIN may be required as well, depending on your bank's security procedures. Once completed, your bank account will be instantly linked and available to use. For those who are not comfortable in providing their online banking username and password, or for those who cannot see the bank that they use listed, you're going to choose other bank. And that will bring in option number two, which is the deposit verification process. This process generally takes two to three business days to complete. The one thing that we do want to note here, it's very important. You have to ensure that the name on the linked bank account must match the verified name on your Coinbase account. We want to choose option number number one, which is instant account verification. We're going to click here and then we're going to click next. If one of the Coinbase listed banks is selected, you will be taken to this page, which is going to prompt you with a login screen specific to your bank. We chose Bank of America and now we've been taken to this login screen, which is going to ask us for our banking username and our banking password. These are used for a one-time verification step. Additional security questions as well as a PIN may be requested depending on your bank security procedures. Your username and password and all other information entered into this process are not stored by Coinbase. And once your bank account has been verified, the logs of your activity are deleted instantly. Verification is simple, secure, and fast. So once we fill this in, we're going to click on next and it's going to log us into our bank account. We are now verified. This screen will appear if you choose other bank. You will be prompted for your bank's routing number, your bank account number, and the name on your bank account. Again, that name must match the name you use to create your Coinbase account. You're also going to be asked for the type of account, whether it's a checking, savings, or business checking. Once you've filled in that information, then you're going to click on next. We're going to use option number two 
two, which is the deposit verification. So we'll click here and then we're going to click next. This pop-up will come up and it's going to tell you to read the instructions carefully. It's going to explain that Coinbase is going to be sending you two small deposits between one cent and 99 cents into your online bank account. Over the next two to three days, these amounts will appear on your statement. You're going to need to come back to Coinbase and tell them the amount of the two deposits to complete the verification. What they want you to do here now is to start that deposit verification. So you're going to click here. Once the deposits have reached your account generating in two to three business days, you can verify the amounts by clicking on the red verify button for your bank account on the payment methods page. Simply enter the two deposit amounts into the verification window. Click on verify deposit amounts and congratulations, your bank account is now verified and you can deposit money into your account. What we want to discuss here is setting up your local currency wallet. In order to deposit money from your bank account and or a credit card or debit card, you will need to ensure that your local currency wallet has been set up. It usually happens automatically, but sometime you will be asked for additional information. Now you're going to use this local currency wallet to hold US funds. You can use it as a source of funds to make instant purchases. You can also credit this wallet from the proceeds of any sale. This means you can instantly buy and sell on Coinbase, exchanging between your local currency wallet and your digital currency wallets. But in order to activate your local currency wallet, you must reside in a support state or country. If you're using a US dollar local currency wallet, then you have to live in the US. If you're in Canada, it would be a Canadian dollar wallet. And you have to have uploaded the identification documents issued in your state or country of residence. And that is where we mentioned filling out your profile information. Under my profile, you may have this pop up. It's going to ask you to fill in the information for identity verification. And once you've completed this information and this pop-up will come saying you have a new USD wallet and that the wallet will let you hold US dollars on Coinbase. Buy and sells using this wallet will be instant and Coinbase does not charge fees for deposits and withdrawals between your USD wallet and your bank account. Here we're going to show you how to deposit money from your bank account to Coinbase. From your dashboard you're going to click on accounts. Once you've done that you're going to see a list of all of your wallets. You're going to see your Bitcoin wallet, you're going to see your Ethereum wallet, you're going to see your Litecoin wallet and and any other wallets that you've added and you're also going to see your USD account wallet. When you want to make a deposit into your USD account wallet you're going to click on deposit. This form will come up and it says bank deposit. Deposit from Bank of America. Now remember your bank has already been linked and verified so this is going to be instant. You're going to enter the amount and then you're going to click continue. This pop-up will come up which is going to have you review that you're going to withdraw and the amount of money that you're going to withdraw from the bank account that you're going to withdraw from. It's going to tell you when the funds will arrive and how much will be deposited into your USD wallet. If everything looks correct to you, then hit the blue button. Confirm. You will get an email saying you started a deposit from your bank account into Coinbase. Once your money is in the account, you will get another email saying that the money has arrived. And basically that's it. That's how you link your bank account and how you're going to deposit funds into your Coinbase USD wallet. At this time I'd like to invite you to join us for our next video where we will be going over an additional payment method of linking your credit debit cards and funding your account. Thank you for your time.